Hello everyone, this is First Up. I'm back with another video today. So in this video, we will discuss about new market updates, anniversary updates, and there are many more things to discuss in this video today. So let's begin without wasting any precious time. So let's begin with the Icon Chronicles update. The bug of emotes and user logo was reported to EA and their response was that this bug is going to be fixed soon so you don't have to worry about it it will be fixed soon and it will be normal let's hit the words anniversary event update so yesterday i already told you that they will give us gift packages from 20 september to 25th september so that means the anniversary event is going to be available around 25th september because previous founders event was available around 28th september so this september month is always for the last event of the seasons since anniversary event is the last event so this event will connect us to the next season this event is going to connect us to Epsim World 25 since these players will also be helpful for us in Epsim World 25. In previous season founders event, the first thing that we had to do is to be a founder and claim the founders user logo. So in this season, there might not be such option, but of course there will be anniversary's logo to claim at first. There were these rewards available as well in the founders that we were able to claim for free. So same type of pattern was available in previous Euro event. We claimed a lot of players and rewards for free. So this type of pattern can be expected in the anniversary event as well since anniversary is the last event. So EA will focus on giving us a lot of rewards. The basic thing about the main events is the skill games and matches. So remember that anniversary event is also a main event. That means we will have skill games and matches to claim the anniversary points. Right now we can claim 98 OVR cards for free from the Hall of Legends and the anniversary event is the last event that is after Retro Stars event. So that means in anniversary event we will be able to claim around 100 OVR card for free. And founders event we had to claim the transition icons and they used to convert to low OVRs in new season so this type of option will not be available in anniversary events since EA confirmed that the players will carry to the next season so they will not decrease in the OVR so I guess this type of option will not be available since the OVR is already high for the next season as well the highest OVR for the retro starts is also 101 OVR so that means in the anniversary event we can expect 102 and 103 OVR as the highest OVRs in that time since we have still a lot of time left we don't know what kind of genes EA will bring so 102 OVR can be expected According to me, users should not miss the anniversary event that is the last event because in last events, EA always gives us highest OVR cards and a lot of rewards. So you should definitely play it. Let's head to extra time update. So the extra time topics are going to expire on 29th August and instead of these picks, there are going to be new rewards available that are a surprise and EA haven't revealed it yet so those rewards also will require the same token that is the market pick token so that means these market pick tokens will be useful in the future as well so you should continue claiming these tokens let's check out the market ones again so the costs of these players have started to rise back as the crash is over right now so if you are still interested in making your team, building your team, you can do it right now. And my suggestion will be to look after the 99 OVR cards. You can purchase the ranked up versions of these players. You can purchase 103, 104, 105 ranked up versions of these players because the cost of the 104 ranked up version player is same and even lesser than the cost of 101 OVR or 101 OVR ranked up version so you should definitely think about it and look after these 99 OVR ranked up versions because they are going to save your coins and you will be 
able to build the highest OVR teams as well. So you should definitely think about it if you want to purchase 101 OVR base card for 200 million coins or at the same time 104 OVR ranked up version under the same cost or the lowest cost. So yes, this is going to be beneficial for you and at the same time you can save your Messerano as well because when you will purchase the rack of versions directly there is no need to spend more Messeranos on the cards and the hectic job will be over for you because we already focus on claiming the Messeranos and save the Messeranos at the same time so when you will purchase these ranked up versions of these players they are going to benefit you a lot they will save your coins save your maserano save your efforts and at the same time you can build your highest ovr team so you can do it right now before the cost of these players will start to rise once again in the market so later on they will be available at the highest cost so at that time of course you will need a lot of coins rather than you need right now so it was all for today you can ask your questions in the comment section i will be back with new fantastic content tell nbc be healthy and take care of it